Wednesday night, the Chicago Bulls were attempting to make it seven consecutive wins against the Bucks. As Derrick Rose continues to look strong after that back injury, real good performance Monday afternoon. Here, Derrick Rose, the block on Brandon Jennings, and on the other end, Luau Dang to Ronnie Brewer to finish with D. Rose started. Now the Bucks try to trap Derrick Rose. Rose finds Joe Kim Noah, who finds Carlos Boozer, and he finds the bottom of the cup. Noah had five assists in the first quarter. Boozer, 14 points in the first half. Now Boozer to Ronnie Brewer. Great cut by Brewer. Good find by Boozer. Bulls led the Bucks 44-37. How about some Milwaukee defense? Larry Sanders, the rejection. And then on the other end, it takes a while, but eventually gets in the hands of Brandon Jennings. And Jennings, the blow by. Lefty style. 57-51, Milwaukee within six. But the Bulls finish up the second quarter really strong. Here's Derrick Rose driving and the foul. Rose finished with 16.7 assists, including this nice move to the bucket, 62-51. It was 64-53 as we headed into the second half. Off the miss, Joe Kim Noah the tip in his 10th rebound of the game. Noticing a trend starting to develop with Noah. Jennings don't care much about that. He had 20 points to lead the Bucks. Off the pick and pop, here's Boozer from Rose. He had a team high 20, 79-65, Chicago in control. And then we complete the story with Joe Kim Noah. He would obtain his first career triple-double. Here are the feed to Taj Gibson, and then Luau Dang to Noah. More familiar with him doing a whole lot of that. With the shot clock winding down, he gets that one to fall. He had 13 points, 10 assists, 13 rebounds. First Bulls center with a triple-double since Artis Gilmore did it back in 1977. Here's Luau Dang. Didn't have a triple-double, but he had 16. Chicago wins it 110-91. Seventh straight win over the Bucks for the Bulls.